everyone, it's Tiana. Today we are checking out a luxurious restaurant hidden inside a castle. Let's just say this is not your typical dining experience. Let's head inside. Now, Blue Blood Steakhouse is a fine dining, modern twist on a classic steakhouse located in the historic Castle Loma in Midtown Toronto. Well, we have all the history and we're mixing that with a more modern take on classic steakhouse cuisine for sure. Though it's located in the historical Castle Loma, Blue Blood still has a modern twist to it. Check out this pop art of Prince in the Oak Room adding a pop of color to the space. We're standing here in the Oak Room, which is one of the most famous parts of the castle. This is where the original owners of the castle would actually entertain their guests. And we're now taking wine from the same wine cellar that they used over 100 years ago and bringing it to guests here in just the next evolution of entertaining in the same special property. Best known for the library of meats they serve, Blue Blood offers everything from aged Canadian AAA steak to other premium cuts like American Wagyu, Australian MB9+, and Japanese A5 Kagoshima, which is around $60 per two ounces. We got this 44 ounce tomahawk steak, but they also have fillets, 40 ounce porterhouses, and 22 ounce bone-in ribeyes. The steaks are served with three different types of salt, each adding a unique character to the tasting experience. Whether you go for the black lava salt, the smoked flaky sea salt, the pink Himalayan salt, or decide to mix them up, you'll be able to customize your meal to your taste. While Blue Blood is considered a steakhouse, they're also known for their fresh seafood. If you're a seafood lover, you can try their classic surf and turf or go all in with their seafood tower. This meticulously constructed tower is packed with fresh lobster, king crab legs, salmon gravelax, east coast oysters, and jumbo prawns that go for $80 a person. Blue Blood is also known for its gorgeous bar and cocktails that will elevate your experiences by touching on different sensory elements. For instance, their once upon a time drink is a mix of bitters and whiskey, which is then garnished with a fragrant star anise. The cocktail is placed under a glass cloche where it is infused with smoke from wood chips. The whole drink is then presented table side where you'll experience the smoke pouring out of the cloche followed by the aroma and flavor infused into your cocktail as you sip it. Once you get out of your car, like the second valet takes your keys from you, you're standing in front of just like an absolute piece of history. And every detail that you walk through is just authenticity. This isn't something that was reproduced. This is truly a historic landmark that's been preserved. A really interesting play on history with modern cooking and a modern atmosphere. It's just, uh, it's a one of a kind opportunity for sure.